I'm at 3012 uh, North 44th Street. Sorry about that. A lot of distractions in my head, so. Everything looks good outside. This trim, the orange trim, which is beautiful color on this house, by the way, uh, really makes the house really pop. But it has to be scraped and painted. Your softening fascia in the back. Let's walk towards the back, and then we'll walk around the house. These gutters, as long as, a gra as long as we could grade, and as long as, again, I'd like to extend these out. I prefer to extending them out, but we don't know, obviously, how the ba basement looks, so we'll see. Um, soffit, it, soffit here is damaged. A little bit of the fascia underneath that gutter is damaged. That's going to all have to be repaired. The windows are older, but they look like they work. The garage this roof is older, but it looks like it works. Uh, we have, uh, it's a two and a half, this is technically almost a two and a half gar car garage because it, the uh, doors are split. Your fencing is in good shape. There's a couple damage, but it works unless, you know, for a rental. Uh, same here, that, that that's fine back there. Uh, again, we have a couple little issues with the roof, but it's fine because, again, this is a rental and this is the edge. This is where the gutter is supposed to sit anyways. Your uh, siding is bad. You can see it was cut, so you can see the bottom, the original siding, then you see the other siding on top of it. And this is actually not good siding anyways. I don't know if you'd like to try to side the garage. That would probably be the best intentions at this point, but if you just want to leave it alone, you could. Uh, the tree above should be trimmed. Not going to the back or to the side of this garage, but it looks like there's things leaning against this garage. We have to see what's happening there. But the soffit needs to be scraped and painted. But uh, the garage looks like it'll probably need some, uh, you know, work on it. Again, soffit and fascia scraped and painted. Mostly the, uh, I should say, mostly the uh, fascia in the eave area. Our spigot out here for the plumbing needs to be uh, updated, repaired. We have a little bit of cracking here. That'll probably have to be, I don't know if that would be considered a code violation. This, this side, obviously the neighbor's using it for their plants. We need to see if we need to grade that. That's gonna, that's affecting the house. Uh, the chimney is going to need some tuck pointing on it. There's some damage, some brick right on this edge. Nothing severe, something that's fixable. Soffit again, there's some areas that are pulling away because this is all wood. I think we're going to have to repair that as well. Here's your neighborhood. Okay. Let's go check out inside.